Well, I've often wondered how far the splatter goes when you're shooting steel, and uh, here's an answer. I've been shooting at this plate here with a 4570, and you can see where the splatter has been going. Mostly, it's been going straight to the sides. If you look over here, so the target's here again. Straight to the side, we've got quite a bit of debris, but there's also quite a bit that's going um, maybe at a 30 degree angle, and if you go farther, there is some debris that's been going at uh, close to 45, maybe even 50 degrees. If you look over here, so I'm looking at the range there, and uh, there's there are a few fragments that have gone into the snow there. And these fragments, this one is going off at a over a 45 degree angle, probably 50 degrees or 55 even. And those few over there were going almost straight back, as were these ones over here. So, I guess that goes to show, oh actually we've got a good fragment over here, a big one. This piece uh, has gone off at about a 30 degree angle. And there are actually some more there, um, around 30 degrees. So. so, all this to say that when you're shooting steel, you don't want to be too close because even though most of the crap goes off to the sides, some of it also goes back towards you.